This is Goldie's Closet episode 118. I'm in a dojo. Check it out. Because our next guest, she's a member of WOW Wrestling. She's a black belt in Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, a real-life superhero. And it's taken her years to hone in this craft. She also is an incredible award-winning graphic designer, motion graph, everything. She does it all. This is the epitome of artist. May Valentine has been saying, how did you, how do you even know her? Because is it through women of wrestling? We just met because we were sharing the same Airbnb, like when I was working for them. And, you know, it was her, it was my first time there. It was her first time there. And we just kind of became like BFF. I was born and bred in Australia, Sydney, Australia played music and I was in a band. Playing what? Uh, bass guitar. So I played bass for like um, 10 years. I know a lot of bands and stuff back home. We toured a lot, you know, we recorded a bunch of albums, you know, had sort of relative success on the sort of punk rock indie scene. You're walking down the street like I would pity the person that would screw with you. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, absolutely. I really can't emphasize the value of self-defense and just general confidence that training a martial art gives a, a woman. There's nothing that empowers you more than walking into a room and knowing that you don't have to worry about, it's not the skill set necessarily that gives you like the edge, I guess, but it's the confidence that knowing that you can. Tell us what you did with Straight Outta Compton. Everybody uses that and rips it off. So I designed the logo for that um, movie. They needed something to just throw at the end of the trailer because they were presenting to the client by the end of the day. I remember just submitting the um, logo designs to the client, going to my lunch break, and then not ever hearing anything about it. Because the reason I hadn't heard anything about it was because I just loved it. So they just ended up using it. You've got 